hey guys welcome back to the next video and in the previous video i have talked about the alternative dimension and in this video let's see the alternative uh, measure so over here we have the dimension but down there i have the measure and i can add as many measure i want but that will change the chart so suppose i don't want to chart but i want to add the alternative measure so let's say uh, for example i have sum of saves but my users are interested in seeing average of saves so i have created this master item earlier and i've given you as an exercise so if you are if you have used that you can easily get it right and let me add uh, one more maybe i want to see uh, average profit as well and i am done so let me click on done now for this region i want to come over here sum of sales and i want to see the average sales and this is what the average sales looks like similarly i want to see the average profit and this is how my average profit looks like so this way i can change the different measures and i can change the different dimension let's say i want to see it by product subcategory then this is how my product subcategory looks like right so that's that's a quick way about how you can add multiple measures so that you don't have to create the new chart for a different kind of measure but add kind of a dynamic behavior within your chart which is kind of a unique and a pretty interesting feature but as i suggested in the previous video don't go for lot many uh, measures anywhere between um, three is the standard which i would say is pretty good as per my experience but at the max go with maximum five if you really really need it right but uh, anywhere be around three is really good so that's about how you can add the alternative measures into the clicks chart